Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Kung nasa man kayo or whatever time na pinapanood niyo itong um, video. Uh, my name is Dylan and uh, welcome to one of my videos. Uh, itong video na to would be more like hindi siya instructional video. Hindi siya yung one of my typical um, CCNA tutorials. Uh, speaking of which, matagal na ako hindi nakapag-upload because I'm so busy. Uh, with work um, I think in last video ko I was still teaching um, ngayon isa na akong uh, network engineer para sa isang ISP uh, sa my Gold Coast this Queensland, Australia alright um, I'm also studying for the A cert sa Cisco uh, Cisco Certified um, Design Associate okay um by the way, speaking of which, alright, so for those of you who are interested lang, that's how I look like. Um, so, pwede tayo maging friends sa uh, LinkedIn kung meron kayong LinkedIn account. So, yeah, if you want to learn more about me, uh, that's a little bit of myself, kung ano educational background ko, my cert. Um, like I said, um, I'm studying for the CCDA because eventually I want to get a CCDP, uh, Cisco Certified Design Professional. Um, and ito yung mga pinag-aaralan ko ngayon. So uh, right after CCDA, hindi ko nga nalagay dyan yung CCDP. Probably I'll do that pag naipasa ko na to and I'll be taking that exam uh, next week. So praying for that. Then, pagkatapos, we have the brocade. I'm gonna be taking the brocade certified network engineer. Ang uh, kagandahan nito, um, mapapansin niyo meron na ako dito ng isang certified certification. Pero the difference between this one and itong BCNE, uh, this one is more into specific the Bayara uh, B router na you know offer ng brocade uh, virtualized router. Ito, it's, ito is more like your equivalent ng CCNA. Okay? Then, um, yeah, this is my ultimate dream. Eventually, maka to become a CCIE. Uh, to be honest, wala pa akong nakikilala personally nor nakikita sa LinkedIn na Filipino CCIE. So, that's one of the reasons kung bakit gusto ko talaga magkaroon nito. Um, okay, aside from that, uh, yan, makikita niyo yung work experience ko. So, Aside from that, I'm also aside from studying and working, I also write a blog, the website ko. So um, madaling tandaan yung yung website. Name of the website is runningconfig.com. Uh, hindi ako pwede magpag AU pero mas maganda na yon para global yung dating niya. Runningconfig.com. If you're familiar with Cisco, alam niyo kung ano yung ibig sabi na running config. So usually Binablog ko dyan yung aking networking um, uh, journey, kung ano yung ginamit ko whenever, ano yung mga tips na pwede kong ibigay, or yung mga natututunan ko while at work, like itong latest na to, when I did the QoS LLQ para mag-prioritize ng video and voice traffic, and uh, yun, mga thoughts ko uh, when I took the exam, uh, and other stuff, I means some, some some random stuff. Okay, um, may mga nagtatanong sa akin. Uh, by the way, maraming salamat for for everybody na nanonood ng aking video. And uh, I would usually send me comments. Thank you so much. Okay, for those of you who are wondering, anong ginawa ko to, to pass the CCNA routing and switching? Um, actually, yung CCNA na tinake ko was the one before yung currently in offer ngayon, which is yung CCNA or CCNA X. Um, there's two ways of getting yung CCNA nyo for routing and switching. You can either take the one exam or you can take the two part exam, which is the ICDN1 and the ICDN2. Um, if you ask me, um, I would do ko ano yung ginawa ko. Uh, just go for the one big exam. 
Ah, uh, marami akong kasama dito na Australians na hin- medyo hindi sila confident na they can actually pass the one big exam. So, ang ginagawa nila is they try taking the two exam. For me, it's like, I can't be bothered. <laughs> so, I can't be bothered studying for one exam, then kalahati lang yung makuha ko. So, uh, might as well just go for one big one and one big one. Ano kaya yun? So, go for one the one big exam. Then, ayun, diretso ko ng CCNA. So, um... That's what I did. Uh, took the one exam. And nang ginawa ko noon, para malaman nyo kung ano yung coverage na exam, so you go to the Cisco website, then makikita nyo, click on review exam topics, and that will give you yung breakdown kung ano yung mga kailangan nyo pag-aralan. That's... So... <laughs> The way you do it is, like, for example, for this one, for the CCNAX, malalaman nyo yung malaking weight is nandun sa lens, which topology, nandun sa IP routing, nandun sa troubleshooting. So, kung bubuksan nyo yung, if you click on the plus sign, makikita nyo kung ano yung laman yan. Alright, so that's how, uh, kung paano yung malalaman kung ano yung ma-covered covered ng exam. Alright? So, obviously, if you are ready, okay, I will tell you kung anong ginawa ko. Um, to be honest, the first thing I did bago ko magsimula mag-aral, I created an account sa Pearson View. I'm not kidding. I created an account sa Pearson View and nag-register ako. Registered Pagka-register ko, pumunta ako sa webpage. Then, sa site ng mga testers. Uh, Cisco. Hey, Cisco. Cisco System. Then, nag-sign in ako. And, come on. Alright. And, um... Ayun, once so mag-sign in ka muna then I think they'll, they'll send you an email then uh, ayan mapupunta kayo dito sa page na to then you click on uh, as you can see here um <laughs> then display ko na yung na display ko tuloy kung kailan ako take na exam so that's for the uh, CCDA um just click on view exam then ayan type nyo lang yung CCMA I think and there and it will just give you the steps or take you through the steps kung paano masasabihin natin English next then well Australian price it's 346 medyo mahal siya anyway I got 2 minutes left um, ano yung mga ginamit ko to learn uh, para mag prepare for this exam um, I was a member since nun tinay ko to I was part of TAFE Para siya equivalent ng AMA or STI dyan sa Pilipinas. So, it's a two-year course. Actually, I only took like six months. Um, I got enrolled sa Cisco Networking Academy. Uh, it's not here anymore kasi tapos na ako. But, um, ito yung official, uh, official uh, study material coming from Cisco. Another... Um, Another website that I would recommend would be CBT Nuggets. Kung matagal na kayo sa Cisco, everybody know who Jeremy Cheo is. And um, of course, Udemy. And I would really, really recommend Chris Bryant. Well, anyway, I just ran out of time. If you have any questions, just feel free to um, mag-add lang kayo ng comment or message niyo ako personally through LinkedIn. Um, and I'll answer them, promise. And until the next video, this is Dylan. See you again.